did get the one on the roof. Oh my god. I also like the rooftop. It makes me want to fly. You too, Stanley Coleman. Oh, Stanley. Oh, there's some big fellers out here. Submachine? What? There's another one. I gotta get it. Damn. I don't think there's anything else up here. I need to... I have to heal myself or I will die. Okay. I don't think there's anything else up here, but I'm going to look just in case. No, there's not anything else up here. Oh, these guys... Creepy, creepy. All day long. Creepy, creepy, creepy. We're going to the basement now. I don't want to, but, you know. <sighs> it's the only thing we have left to do. Let's go to the basement down here. More of this, uh, said submachine gun. I'm excited about the submachine. I like this. I like this a lot. This reminds me of Silent Hill 1. I like this. It's a wheelchair. Where's the person that was using it? Man, I don't know. Oh, they probably are dead. But I did find a submachine gun. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Let's take... Oh, Heather. You just get the coolest weapons. Look at that. Oh, and how much ammo do I have for it? I picked up, like, three. Oh. Stun gun battery? I should use that. Oh my god. Oh my god. Thank you, Silent Hill 3. You're welcome. Alright. Blood trail continues into the elevator. Part of me wants to peek in, but then it's a little creepy too. Okay, well... Alright. I don't like this room. Streaks of blood as if something got dragged are continuing on to the back of the shelf. No, it's more like they start at the back of the shelf. Hmm. Well, in one of the diaries, it said something about a key down here. The key to the door, which would be the code, which I think might be on the back of the shelf. Shake it like a Polaroid picture. One, four, nine, three. Good. Good. Good, good. I was really hoping to take fatal frame pictures, though. Fatal frame. Camera obscura. Yeah. Oh. I clicked the stairs like it was going to, uh... <laughs> like I was going to have to do a stick going up the stairs cutscene like in Resident Evil. Oh, 
a bit. Oh, God. I just hate to see any more of those Stanley Diaries. Those, those are just so creepy. Good, we're right here. 1493. What was I doing? That was weird. Okay. Hmm. It's a magazine. Just some kind of gossip magazine. Teaching Despair. Hope House. Hope House, an orphanage on the outskirts of Silent Hill. But behind... But behind its false image is a place where children are kidnapped and brainwashed. Hope House is managed by the Silent Hill Smile Support Society, a charity organization sometimes called 4S. It's true that 4S is a well-respected charity that takes in poor children without homes and raises them with hope. But at its heart, it is a heathen organization that teaches its own warped dogma in lieu of good religious values. Mr. Smith, temporary, who lives near Hope House, had this to say. Sometimes at night, I can hear their weird prayers and the sounds of children crying. I went there to complain one time, but they ran me right out. Since then, it hasn't changed a bit. In fact, this reporter refused admission when he attempted to take photographs in the facility. What exactly do the folks at Hope House have to hide? During my investigations, I was able to discover, however, a suspicious looking round concrete tower which appears to be part of their facilities. Unfortunately, no one was willing to tell us what the tower was used for but it seems unlikely that it has anything to do with the business of raising orphans. Because that's serious business. It may, in fact, be a prison or a secret place of worship. The cult religion that operates Hope House is known by the locals simply as the Order. It's a religion that is deeply interwoven with Silent Hill's history, but its worshippers' fervent belief that they are among the elite chosen people has a dark and dangerous side. I intend to continue my investigation of Hope House and the cult behind it. I've always believed that telling the whole truth and showing the children showing the children the true path is our most important duty. Joseph Schreiber. Hope House. I feel like I've heard that name before. I haven't. I mean, unless they're talking about Silent Hill 4, but it wasn't called Hope House in Silent Hill 4. I watched a Let's Play of it. It was called something else, but I can't remember what it was. Ugh. Oh, beef jerky. Om nom. Om nom. <laughs> Lock's broken. Box broken. Box broken. Oh. 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 Oh, and the doll's broken. The doll is broken. Oh. The doll is all torn apart. It's pretty sad to look at. I wonder who did it anyway. Ugh. Goodbye, Heather. I'm sorry I wasn't able to respond to your love. It's all over. Leonard despises me because I made fun of it saying it would come to this. If it weren't for his meddling, I would have been able to meet you in just a little while. Then I could have taken you to my world. A world for us alone, more beautiful than this one. And I had been waiting for this day for today. The day I'd see you, the day you'd save me, today. Heather, watch out for him. 
Leonard is no ordinary guy. Farewell. I loved you. Heather, my goddess. Heather, my, Heather, my lover. Heather, my... Oh. I don't know whether to be creeped out or sad. I'm kind of sad. 